Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's hey, I was poppin'? What's poppin'? What's hey, um, how y'all doing? How y'all living? How y'all feeling? I'm just literally just sitting here. Like, I'm supposed to be doing work, but my computer is so effing slow. Like, I have to go to the Apple store. Low key, I need to raise money. Or just like suck it up and use my taxes and buy uh, a Mac, like the the desktop, and let that be what I um edit my videos on and all that stuff because my poor baby, she's moving so slow. Like I definitely definitely know I need a new hard drive. Um, I need uh, a new battery. But yeah, um. Since I've been praying and like reading this manifest manifestation book and um, doing other things that just recalibrated my mind, I've noticed that I've been introduced to, excuse me, a plethora of people like creatives who are doing stuff that can help possibly help me possibly advance my brand. The thing about it is, is that Essence of Shay was just like cultivated by accident. Let's just keep it a buck. This is not something that I sat down and said, yes, I need to do. This was started because like I was bored. I was in a bad mental space. I went on YouTube and YouTube, I just liked watching people's videos. Um, Patricia, I remember her back in the day where she her makeup was trash basket. She would say it now, but now she's flawless. She's doing big campaigns and all this stuff. But like, I remember back then, and I started it just to start it. It had nothing to do with hair or anything. Like I was singing up there. I showed like cooking videos, and then people started asking me about my hair. So. Then I started focusing that on that, and then I realized how important um, me doing that was and how having locks, in a sense, changed my life for the good. So, yeah, so now, like, the brand has cultivated itself, and I feel like I kind of was overwhelmed by it not because of the money because i still not making money like that off of essence of shade keep it a buck that's why i have a full-time job um but overwhelmed by the response from people um because i'm i was so used to like negative energy so like when you're thrust into a situation where all you get is positivity but you're so used to like negative stuff throwing at you believe it or not it becomes overwhelming <laughs> um yeah so i'm super happy about that so now i'm starting to see that dallas seems to be like a good move because i am running into like some pretty dope people and aligning myself with pretty dope people i still need to like network uh, some more it's kind of hard um, I use the car thing as an excuse but I have to stop doing that because I can still get around I can still take a uber I can still take a train or a bus um, if I knew somebody's going I could still take a ride with them I just need to stop making excuses and go out there and network um, because that will help me build my brand to what it it should be and also help me connect with some pretty dope individuals. Um, but yeah, like I just did my headshots. I'm waiting for those to come back. Um, I also have a dope photographer that I'm working with just to like, so my Instagram could step up and not just be a bunch of selfies, but also it's good for my website as well. I also just connected with this videographer that I'm gonna do almost like a campaign for essence of shade so people could hear like the backstory of it and you know just be more 
um, understanding of what the brand is. You know what I mean? So I'm pretty happy about that. I just need to get out of this lazy spirit. This lazy spirit, yo. When I'm off, I just be wanting to sleep. And I can't do that. Can't do that. But yeah, this is my back my backdrop. Um, right now, I only have the brown and yellow paper. I want to get this pink one. But I just like how the brown looks on my skin, boy. Um, yeah, so I have a video that I recorded. I'm probably going to put that out before I put out this or after either way. But I just wanted to talk to y'all, let y'all know like a bit of background and just I'm going to definitely be vlogging more because I just like that. And then I'm going to incorporate just my lock journey and stuff like that as I as I go along doing it. Um, <clears throat> if you haven't already, please go to my site, www.essenceofshade.com. Check out the site. Uh, check out my blog. Check out Keep It Stepping, which is my podcast. Um, check out my web store. Uh, some dope stuff is out there. My cover oil, my lavender hair spritz, my ebook on how this is just a simple ebook. It's like two ninety nine. How to help you grow and maintain healthy locks. Um, yeah, and I'm writing my book. Super dope about that. It's pretty draining because I'm digging deep. Because you guys know I'm always sitting here talking to y'all about my life. So, <sighs> it's releasing though to sit down and write it. Um, yeah. Anyways, I'm about to head to the gym. I'm going to definitely bring y'all with me because y'all know I like y'all being in my business. <laughs> Alright, y'all. Um, see y'all after the gym. I definitely need to cook. No, I have food in the fridge. Yo, I forgot to tell y'all. So, hold on. So, I bought a bed. Right? Here's my bed. I need a box spring. That's the mattress. It looks pretty thin, but it's like a memory a memory foam thing. But because I don't have the box spring and I don't have no sheets, <laughs> fam, look at how your girl been sleeping. In the living room, on a blow-up bed, in the, li like, am I a bachelor? Like, what's happening? You can't take me nowhere. Like, what's the thesis? Anyways, um, let's head to the gym because I haven't been since Sunday, and today is Thursday. That's what I'll be saying. When, I, when I'm at work, when I get off, I don't want to work out. Like, I'm tired. And I can't wake up hella early because I have to take the bus to work. And the train... See, let me tell y'all my schedule. So, the gym opens at 5. I have to be to work at 7. If I had a car, I could get up and go to the gym at 5, get ready, be on the work. But I don't have a, a vehicle. So, I have to get up at 5 o'clock, get ready and catch the bus for 5.58, right? And then get to, and then I get to work by like 6.45 or something like that. So it doesn't allow me time to go work out in the mornings like I like to do. And then by the time I get off, your sis is tired, boy, tired. And then I gotta work and edit and all this stuff. I'm making mad excuses now that I sit down and think about it. Because if it's something I really wanted to do, I would pack my bags, sis, and I'll go to the... You know what? 86, what I just said. Yes, she just used cooking terms. 86 it. Let's go to the gym. And we out of there.
crash course Let me hide the money in the dashboard Max mad, could you lost the brick inside the Porsche Goofy with the curb